tutorial i am going to show you how to write a very uh, very log code in the vivado software and i for demonstration purpose i have written a very log code for the half header i have also written the test bench and uh, the simulation result are also shown in this tutorial so first of all i will click on the software and open it so the vivado software has opened now we will create a new project and by clicking this icon create project next next and there is an rtl project next product category or this is rtx7 and this is depending upon the package which we have i have the package cgs324 and we can go for this two f so my project is been created now in the vivado software this will show my project summary the synthesis part is not been started the implementation is not yet started so after implementation i can see everything here the timing the power analysis also can be performed here the next step is to add the design sources so i will right click on, on this one and add sources i have to add or create sources or i can add previously created sources if they are available i can also add the files i would like to create a file and i can name it any file like half adder now this file is been created i can give the input output here also or i can write directly in the program i will i prefer to write directly in the program okay so if i want to edit the code i have to go to this thing this is the half adder code design source this is the module and this constitute of the module name the half and next we have to write the variables which are using so we are using s c out sum c out a comma b then we have to individually mention the input and the output part our input part is a comma b and output part is s comma c out and as you know that for the sum we have to do the zor of a b and for the carry we have to do the and of a comma b so if our code has a syntax correct then we will have a green box mentioned here and if we have any error for example if this semicolon is not there then this will lead to a red color and it will also tell us what is the what is the error in our code so this completes the design part now the next part is the test bench test bench part first we have to mention the module stimulus it is also known as stimulus block okay then all the inputs of our design are mentioned as a register r e g what are our inputs a comma b and all the outputs are mentioned as wire what are our outputs s comma c out so this completes the initial part next i have to write my conditions so i will begin with the initial block and write the begin statement and i can give a delay of nanoseconds of the required value for example i am giving 10 nanoseconds now stack and uh, the hash signifies for the delay hashtag 10 now a comma after 10 seconds the a the value of a comma a will become this is the syntax to write the binary digits 1 comma 0 similarly after 20 seconds i can write the value of b is equal to 1 comma 1 
now this thing can go on for many cases as you can see i have taken six test cases for a and b and i have written at last has 20 and that is after the delay of 20 seconds finish the stimulus block and end now the next thing will be that i have to write a statement for printing the output for that i again have to write an initial block and his dollar monitor this is a syntax so we have to follow this dollar monitor dollar time for if you want to go in detail of writing the very log code you can refer the book that is samir palatnikar very log hdl book it is a very useful book and now i will write the statement for printing the output <coughs> the monitor statement that is for a b c s and c out i forgot to mention one thing here after the register and wire the register is for the input the wire is for the output that we have to instantiate the design module also so the design module is half so with the same name we have to instantiate your half and give it any name i have given it as the h1 and according to the order of the output and the outputs as we have arranged in the design module we have to again call them sc out and ab and after the test cases after doing this we have to save this by pressing this icon and then we have to run the simulation part so it will ask for run behavior simulation we have to click here so as we can see a new window has popped up here and title 12 we have to open it and uh, zoom out to see the waveform and does it satisfy the condition let us see so see we can see it satisfies the truth table whenever the whenever the a or b anyone is high the sum is high and when both are high the sum is zero and the c out is one which verifies the truth table of the half adder so this completes the designing of a uh, basic code in the vivardo and uh, we have uh, designed a half adder uh, along with its test bench and simulated in the vivardo software so in the next video i will try to make the synthesis part and the implementation part on the fpga board so here it completes my video if you have any queries you can post in the comment section thank you